What's up, fam? It's your boy G-Fi here, coming at you with another vid. <clears throat> Jokes, could you imagine? That would have been weird. All right, back to script. Some of the best gaming experiences come when you're hanging with some friends, it's 2am all of a sudden, and one of your friends says, Hey, I bought this Xbox Live game for $1, wanna try it? And you're like, okay. And before you know it, you're climbing a mountain of men in speedos, having a great time, but also being a little bit concerned for said friend's mental well-being. So, we wanted to pay homage to those 2am games and show you some of the weirdest games we've played. Since I don't have anything else to add. Since I already brought up climbing mountains of men, let's start there. It's Mount Your Friends. This game isn't as hard as it looks. Each button is con <laughs> Sorry. Each button is connected to a different limb and you have to get your character up the mountain above a certain threshold before the time runs out. You can try and sabotage your friends by making weird and wonderful shapes. There's just no way! There's just no way! Why? Goat Simulator is a game most will be familiar with and is certainly the most well-known game on this list. The premise of the game is simple. Go be a goat. Live like a goat. Eat like a goat. Uh, skate, skate like a goat. Shop like a goat. Kill like, kill like a goat. And get abducted like a goat. You know, goat stuff. Deadly Premonition is a survival horror game where you play as a character conflicted by two sides of his subconscious. Did you see that, Zach? F. K. In. The coffee. I knew I could count on it. it. Never fails. The story is bizarre and will have you wondering what's going on in almost every scene. But there lies its charm. The following scene is just a snippet into the wild world of Deadly Premonition. Mrs. Olivia Cormack, I am here for Mr. Stewart's lunch. If it is ready, I'd thank you a bunch. Yes, of course. Just a moment. Here you go. The usual. One turkey, strawberry jam, and cereal sandwich. Sounds like the sinner's sandwich. Self-inflicted punishment to atone for past sins. He's setting an example. Mr. Francis York Morgan, you should try this wonderful lunch. It's more than a delicious, tasty crunch. Hmm? Mm, I can't believe it. This is fantastic. It's really good. Olivia. I'm sorry, but can I change my order? I'll have what Harry is having. While we're here, if you want to make a video game for your brand in minutes and not months, you can do that with our game maker platform, Gizmo. I've left a link in the description and you can try it for free. And while we're here, don't forget to smash that like button. Smash it. Um, jokes, of course. Like the video if you like it and don't if you do not. Back to it. I Am Bread is a game where you are bread. It has a similar premise to Goat Simulator, where you are something, and a similar game mechanic to Mount Your Friends, where each button controls an assigned limb, using strong quotation marks there. It's high in carbs and low in normality. I personally haven't picked this game up yet, but I can't wait to play it. Last, and probably also least, but they're all pretty bad, it's Alveoli, or Alveol, I don't know. I picked this game up because I saw the dev tweet about it and I thought the art style looked cool. But man, I really just felt like a hamster on a wheel in this game. And that's mainly because you literally just run on a wheel for the entire game. You pick up achievements by completing certain combinations of running and jumping, and that's it. I get that this game is probably supposed to be some sort of metaphor about consciousness, or death, or both, or neither. Um, I don't know, but the gameplay just isn't worth the seven and a half dollar dues it cost me. And that's all for now. Don't forget to hit that blue like button if you liked the video, and subscribe for regular content.
What's the weirdest game you've played? Let us know in the comments. And as always, for more info about gamification, head to our website at gamify.com. See ya.